Hey everyone, it's Thursday and it's time for yet another quick video devotion to follow along with your family. This week we're focusing on scriptures about teaching, as we're going to be showing our appreciation for all educators, both professional and otherwise, this coming Sunday during our 11 a.m. worship service. For today, I'm in 2 Timothy chapter 3, and the Apostle Paul is writing to his assistant and friend Timothy. He's probably writing from prison, and he's perhaps even believing that he's going to be dead soon. And so, 2 Timothy feels a little bit like a farewell letter. Therefore, Paul is encouraging his friend Timothy to hold strong in the face of persecution and false teaching. In fact, a lot of 2 Timothy deals with false teachings. Starting in chapter 3, verse 10 and following, Paul uses his own experience and example as sources for Timothy's teaching. Timothy may have been feeling under a lot of pressure with Paul in prison, and perhaps he was quite afraid. But Paul gives Timothy several reasons why he can be strong in what he's been taught. Have there ever been some really great teachers in your life? I'm willing to bet that there's at least one teacher who stands out. Maybe they helped open your eyes to a passion you didn't know you had. Or maybe they modeled extraordinary character and integrity. Maybe they supported you during a particularly difficult time in your life. Those are the teachers that we tend to remember forever. And Paul was that kind of teacher to Timothy. They were actually even closer, more like father and son in the faith. Paul reminded Timothy of all that he had endured for the sake of the gospel of Jesus Christ. He did this because he knew that Timothy was capable of the same strength. And Paul reminds him that he knew the scriptures very well also. And when he says scriptures, by the way, or sacred writings in this passage, he's actually just talking about the Old Testament because the New Testament hadn't yet been written or, or compiled together in a single document. So Timothy had a great teacher in Paul. And just like Timothy, we've all had great teachers. We've had great women and men in our lives who have helped us to grow in learning, in character, and in strength. And these special people are our teachers at school, they're our teachers at church, our neighbors, our relatives, and yes, our parents. So I invite you today to read 2 Timothy chapter 3, verses 10 through 17 with your family. Then talk together about those special people who have really been great teachers in your life. I challenge you to even find a way to reach out to those teachers and give them a word of thanks. Gratitude can be a wonderful thing. It encourages the people who receive it, and it really blesses the people who give it. So until next time, I hope you'll stay safe, stay healthy, stay home, and find a friend with whom you can share this video devotion. We'll see you soon.